Greetings, nerds. Welcome to the sixth episode of If Foods Were Drawn as Humans. Now, the next spicy product that I'm going to draw as a human is Doritos Flamas. So, without any further ado, let's go ahead and get right into work. Doritos Flamas are just like uh, the Flamin' Hot Doritos, but because of the spicy chili flavor, the only difference is that the Doritos Flamas have a little bit of that lime taste uh, every time you munch on the chips. I'm going to be 100% honest with you nerds. I'm not. I'm kind of a fan and kind of not a fan of Doritos Flamas. I like Flamin' Hot Doritos better. I feel like they're. I don't know. Uh, I feel like there's an imitation between the Flamin' Hot Doritos Lemon and Doritos Flamas because both have a little bit of the the citrus taste on every chip that's in these bags it's weird like these companies they just like to create unusual and silly decisions in order to get these people's attention In this episode, I decided to, instead of using a black pen, I decided to use a skinny black Sharpie marker uh, to draw over in pencil, to draw over the, the pencil uh, tracing, you get what I'm trying to say, drawing over a uh, pencil, but anyway, uh, I decided to stick with a skinny black sharpie marker because I want to like get to the coloring process a little bit sooner I want to be able to like find a way to get to the coloring process a little bit faster so I guess it was the, the perfect choice for me to a perfect decision for me to use a skinny sharpie marker instead of a black pen because I want to be able to like do this faster just a bit Shadow. Don't wait, it's spicy. 
I got quite curious. The word flamas is actually a Portuguese word for flames. I thought it was a Spanish word at first, but it's actually a, a Portuguese word. But the Spanish word for flames is llamas. And I'm not really too good with uh, Portuguese and Spanish. I'm, I'm a little bit better at Spanish, but I don't know 100% of Spanish. I guess I know maybe, uh, I would say, maybe 50, between 15 to 20% of Spanish. There's just so many words to learn of these different languages. It's insane. It could take ages. It could take yeah, it just takes ages to learn a different language like that. Learning millions of words. And I can't really master that. Doritos Flamas actually has a Taco Bell, like, meal. I think it's called Fiery Dorito. It's a Doritos taco. That's, uh, it, except it's not called Doritos Flamas. Instead, it's called Doritos Fiery. It's that taco from Taco Bell that has the spicy tortilla, the spicy Dorito tortilla shell. Yeah, I actually never tried it. I did try the Cool Ranch uh, Dorito taco as well as the nacho cheese one. Those are just on point, quite frankly. Those are just on point. They also make me do number two every time I eat them. primary colors of the Doritos Flamas bag are mostly purple with a little bit of orchid uh, touch to it, a little bit of red orange, and also a little bit of golden yellow. But the majority of the color is purple with a pinch of orchid, which is a type of purple color but a little bit of magenta to it. I decided to give my person a button shirt that's purple, pants that are purple, shoes that are golden yellow, and a strip of hair that's red orange because I, I wanted to make sure my person is perfectly matched with the design of the Doritos Flamas.
Doritos Flamas may be hot. It may be quite spicy. I wanted to make sure my person is looks cool. And it makes sense because purple is one of the cool colors on the color wheel. I, I guess I want purple to cool down the spiciness of these chips.